Ooh, I like the sound of the exhaust. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the dork side. We got big things going on right now. You may have noticed, this is not a CB500F. In fact, I am right now test driving, test riding uh, versus 650 LT, Kawasaki baby. So I've been thinking about upgrading from the uh, from the CB, and versus has popped up on my radar. Oh, the turn signals in a different place. Stupid Honda turn signals. So I'm riding the bad boy. This is a 2016. It's orange. LT's got the bags, which I like. Um, so far, it feels light, nimble. I like that. Um, I sat on the thousand. It's pretty wide. I might ride it today too, but it doesn't feel as as light and nimble. I'm concerned about power, but I know this has got more than my other bike. And um, I really, really like the look of this bike. I really like this orange color. There we go. Really like it. So, so far. Oops. God damn it. Turns out I'm going to be honking this horn a lot. All right. Well, get up and go is good. Yeah, I feel comfortable. This bike feels very comfortable. It's freezing today, by the way. It's 32 degrees right now. So, hell of a day to test ride a bike, but at least it's not raining. Huh. All right. Well, so far, very comfortable and no noticeable difference weight wise or sort of. Uh, turning suspension it feels wow no i think it's more flickable than the 500 honestly um more upright seating position the seat's really comfortable it's leaning forward a little bit more than i would like but i can push back up against the backrest I couldn't do that can't hardly do it in the 500 yeah i don't know i like this so far it's a nice bike i'm also i think going to test ride the fj09 and the uh they have a versus 1000 they have a pretty decent looking deal on a versus 1000 2016 it's still new but this one's got 3000 or 20 yeah 3000 miles on it <sighs> lugging it a little bit um it's got abs my bike doesn't have abs and this one's seven thousand dollars so okay i don't like the pitch forward seat one downside i'm definitely feeling that right now all right he said go out <laughs> it doesn't it feels feels like it has power when i want it but controllable it's not like scary i need to hold the clutch in all the time power um i was worried about the seat height but it's the same height as my crf and uh it feels fine i don't feel bad about it at all oh shit i'm just gonna honk at everybody forever Oh yeah, it's got a little bit more grunt than the other bike. Damn. Huh, I don't hate it. I don't hate it. Oh, it gets up and goes for sure. It is fucking cold. I'm cold. The handguards actually help with the cold, keep my hands warm. Uh, I'm very upright on this bike, which I enjoy. Oh yeah, get a highway speed. Hell, I'm going 70 and I didn't realize it. I don't like the mirrors. They definitely need to be adjusted or I adjusted them once, but they don't seem like they're far off. I can't see behind me. They're not far out enough. It's interesting. Uh, the wind protection. There's a lot here. Definitely hitting the top of my head. Right here. Now, there's a little bit of a crosswind today, I think. So that's what I'm feeling. Mm, I don't know. I don't hate this bike. I do not hate it. This is a good little loop. Feels like it's got power when you want it but it's not going to do anything surprising i've read that these bikes are fun through the power band but very controllable so you can flog the shit out of them and they and uh you can make a mistake and it won't kill you like it will on a bigger bike i'm a little concerned about riding the bigger ones to be honest <sighs> so it's at 75 horsepower i think I'll go, let's go state and style Oh, it ships smoothly, feels like. It does not it, it does not feel like a bigger bike than the other one. In fact, it reminds me more of my CRF than my CB when I come to a stop. Or that's because it's taller. God damn, I don't know. I like it. Let's try getting on the highway. Right here is the on-ramp. It's fucking cold. Did I mention that's cold? It's pretty cold. 
Ah, it's just nimble, baby. She's just nimble. She just goes. All right, let's get on the fucking highway. This bike is a lot. I'm not even pushing it right now. Oh yeah, that's speed when you need it. This is ECO. Look at this. Can't check my blind spot for shit with this camera on. You guys probably only see the windscreen. I'm looking right over it. I don't see it at all. I don't know what gear I'm in. Gear indicator would be nice. On the highway, it's smooth, it's nice. Um, way, what am I running at? 4,500? The CB would be fucking struggling right now. Struggling at 65. Not a grunty little engine, I like it. This is comfortable. It's a comfortable bike, but it doesn't look like a big old man bike. It doesn't look like a scary huge cruiser or anything. I mean, scary huge is not the right word, but like a big concourse or something. I just don't like the way those bikes look. And I feel like the thousand looks like that. It feels like a boat. We'll see when I get on it, but I don't know. This is this is nice. This is nice. Comfortable. Feels confident and planted. It's a good bike. I don't know. It's got like a little tiny bit of off-road ability just because it has a longer travel suspension. But I mean I have a CRF. I don't need to go off-road. But damn, I don't know. I dig it. Um, it's not like throw you snap your neck powerful but it's got more than i'm asking it for right now so that's fun that's pretty fun so the downshifting no downshifting doesn't give you much no not at all of course what gear am i in well, that clutch engagement is weird and it's all the way out there probably better it's cold bro i'm cold Oh yeah, stopping is easy. Put my foot down is easy. I was worried it wouldn't be. It's cake. It feels normal, natural. It's good stuff. I like it. Fucking cold right now. This is this is top of the list. It feels real good. I like it. My ass feels comfortable. I'm driving a, a recliner. Maybe not a recliner, but a comfortable office chair. These bumps and shit, it just soaks them up like nothing. Like nothing at all. I don't hate it. Don't hate it. Do not. Should we put it back where it was? What do you think? Hmm? I just moved them around so I can. <laughs> yeah, my legs are a little cold. Oh. This jacket does okay though, otherwise. Okay. Oh, it's great. I like it. Okay. It's real smooth. Softy and easy, comfy seat. Yeah. Yeah, position. yeah which I like. Yeah, so yeah. you're going to probably not like the seat on the, uh, the FZ09, but hey, you just got to try the, uh, right. the comfort of well, it. Yeah. Well, yeah. That way I'll know I don't like it. Yeah, absolutely. You <laughs> don't ever roll one out until you say, I've ridden it. Yeah. Me. Yeah, right. Okay, thank you. I really enjoyed my test ride of the Versus 650 today and it's definitely a bike that has made its way to the top of the bikes I'm considering picking up. Stay tuned for upcoming videos on the Versus 1000 LT, the FJ09, and the V-Strom 650. Thank you. Excellent! Yay!